so exciting times. We're in apartment four, and today is all about demolition. We need to turn this into this. And you're about to see how it's done. It's a, uh, it's a bit worrying. You should, hang on, hang on, hang on, before we do that. Head hard hat? Oh yeah, maybe hard hat, but also, are we sure that that isn't cemented in there to keep those beams up? Well. Because, are we sure that they are one long beam and they, they're they not? Well, have a look in there, what do they look like? I don't really know, to be honest with you. Maybe take one piece out and just see. I just don't want if they've if they've infilled that, like with just a small beam. Do you know what I mean? Them beams go across. They definitely go across. Yeah. Yeah. They're not going to fall. Well, they're the same as these. Yeah. Yeah. When I took the this part of the wall is exactly the same as that part of the wall. See, so we think it'll be fine. I think they'll be. Yeah, I'd be Why? very, very surprised. Just do it tentatively. Well, I'd be very surprised if they uh, are anything other than what I think they are. I think, I think it's probably a good idea to go along because these are not even connected to these beams. Yeah. These beams are from here to here, which is the construction of it. Yeah. Yeah.
elevated and shittery um, with a trailer load of rubble from part of the wall we finished up yesterday um, taking down a couple of the uprights it was um, it's hard going because <coughs> excuse me the uh, wall is not just lath and plaster so it's not just wooden strips with a bit of infill of old mortar and mud and whatever you like this is infilled with um, Tomek tiles, concrete, there is wire within the concrete and then you've got the lass on that side so you've got these little wooden strips which are made of oak so they're not you know made of tissue paper so they need to come off and all that sort of thing but um, on the other side you've got um, rendered concrete over the top which again has wire in it and then probably up to about two inches of plaster uh, on duit, uh, that they call it here and then on top of that you've got ceramic tile so trying to get that lot off is a hell of a job and uh, so we've got probably at least another run like this although we've got an awful lot of it off but at least another run to the dechettery with a trailer load of stuff and obviously because this isn't just stone or mud or anything like that we can't put it in the land we have to take it and dispose of it elsewhere so again that takes time there is a bonus obviously for someone because we're going to add a shattery stroke maximums and maximums is probably the most favorite place of my wife so that is a bonus for her that she can sit there and go right i'll leave you unload the trailer i'm just popping in the shop oh yeah like i do that <laughs> obviously she doesn't do that she's very very good at helping out but she's not well so she's poorly at the moment so i would so i might today yeah <laughs> so you i would rather you go in the shop and I'll, I'll, it just takes you know it's not like it's an hard job it just takes a bit longer than normal but yeah that's the state of play so the, the plan is today is to get the rest of it out and i don't want to be doing it tomorrow um i've got places to be tomorrow don't want to be doing it tomorrow so it's going to be however long it takes today i may well have to nip to the jachetry in the morning um if it takes longer than i think but if i can get most of it out before the jachetry shuts at about five five o'clock then that'll be resolved
put your hard hat on. That's how you demolish a wall in two days. Brilliant work, babe. Fantastic. <laughs> Thoroughly Don't forget, enjoyable. Like and subscribe. We'll see you again next week. Don't forget them thumbs up. Take care, everyone. Bye. Bye. Is this Come when on. we do a special handshake? Special handshake? Well, when we was doing that, we could do it like. No? Okay. Come <laughs> It's terrifying. I have to live with it. <laughs> <laughs>